Great resignation. We've heard a lot about it over the summer months, even witnessing the trend here in Colorado. Nine News legal expert Whitney Trailer joins me now. And Whitney, you've been looking at some of the data that suggests that resignation might actually be slowing down. Can you tell us what you found? That's right. Good morning, Natasha. In August, actually, the Colorado Colorado's rate of people who quit was 5.04%, which was higher than the national average. But a few months later in December, Colorado's rate was only 3.38%, which was lower than the national average. So right now, both Colorado and the nation are under 4% of people who are uh, resigning. Uh, which is still much higher than it was in December of 2020. And this is driven largely by the service sector employees who are using this tight labor market to secure better working conditions, like we're seeing actually with King Supers. So we expect more resignations, but obviously not as many as in the past year. Okay, and each week, Whitney, you've been highlighting Colorado employers who are hiring. Who are you featuring this week? Right. This week, we're fe featuring Spectra Centers. My good friend, Amy Gerhard, she reached out and said, hey, we have a bunch of positions and they offer psychological and behavioral services to children and young adults with autism. And so they have positions like paraprofessionals and behavior techs. They have speech language pathologists, occupational therapists, and they have the uh, pay range on that from 56 to 63 grand. Great benefits, good company, happy employees. So they can find out more information at spectracenters.org or go to our website, 9news.com. And remember, employers, if you're hiring, reach out to me, send me an email, and we'll get you featured on one of our Help Wanted Wednesday segments. All right, sounds good. Whitney Trailer, thank you as always. All right, thank you.